Patients with severe hemophilia A are often treated with regular plus episodic infusions of factor VIII. But these infusions are burdensome, and in about 30% of patients, antibodies to factor VIII develop. To address these problems, emicizumab was designed. Emicizumab is a humanized bispecific antibody that mimics the function of factor VIII. In a small trial in Japan, 18 patients with severe hemophilia A were identified. 11 patients already had factor VIII antibodies, and 7 did not. These 18 patients were broken up into three groups and given different doses of emicizumab. 0.3 mg, 1 mg, or 3 mg per kilogram of body weight was administered subcutaneously once per week for 12 weeks. Endpoints of the study were safety, pharmacokinetics, and pharmacodynamics. In addition, annualized bleeding rates during treatment were compared with bleeding rates collected six months before treatment began. There were no serious adverse events with emicizumab. Plasma concentrations of emicizumab rose in a dose-dependent manner. The median annualized bleeding rates for the three groups decreased from 32.5 to 4.4, 18.3 to 0, and 15.2 to 0. There was no bleeding in 8 of the 11 patients with antibodies, or in 5 of the 7 patients without antibodies. Episodic use of clotting factors was reduced to 0 for the majority of patients, and overall mean use was decreased by half. From this short-term study, the authors conclude that once-weekly subcutaneous administration of emicizumab was well-tolerated and markedly decreased the number of bleeding episodes in patients who have severe hemophilia A, regardless of antibody status. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.